Hey guys, what's going on? It's Amy again with Bargain Mama, and this is our view. You know, I'm doing what I can from our Airbnb. Um, we are making it through. We are hoping for Wednesday or Thursday. We signed on our house on Friday, so we technically own our house. Um, and so yeah, we are ready to get moving in this upcoming week. I cannot wait to show you guys my house and everything else, so I apologize for the view, but I had to do this video because I cannot wait to show you guys. I'm sure by the thumbnail that I'm hoping is going to come up, you guys are going to see I found the calendars. I am so excited. I got some for me and I got some of every single one of them for you guys. So let's get started and um, I will throw the calendars in in just a little bit. So, what did I pick up? So, why, I don't know, but you guys, how cute is this little thing? Yeah, so I got this little flamingo. I absolutely have no idea. I just thought, oh, luau party, flamingo. I don't think flamingos are luau, but I just thought it was so cute. And yeah, so I got the little flamingo. It does turn on when you um, obviously pull the thing. I'm gonna try to get the glare to stop. Oh my gosh, I don't really know how to use these blinds very much. Okay, stop. Anyways, so I got the little flamingo. I thought it was cute. I did, so I'm gonna, oh, I kind of like this because then I can set it right here. Anyways, let me show you guys what I got. I found two, oh, I do kind of like this view because then you guys can see all my stuff. I got two different um, flavors of the Premier Protein. I have not tried this one yet, guys. So this one is the smooth and creamy with oats, blueberries, and cream. One gram of sugar, seven grams of fiber, and 20 grams of protein, 11 fluid ounces. Have not tried this one yet. I'm excited to try it. It's good until December of 2021. Belle likes this one. Is this Belle approved? Yeah, say this is Belle approved. Guys, I tried this one today, bananas and cream. Oh my gosh, it's so good. It is amazing. I was like, mm, I cannot wait till we move into our house and I get my little Nutribullet out. I'm probably gonna make it a horribly unhealthy shake, but I'm like, oh my gosh, like I can't imagine like putting in some more bananas with this and oh, it's amazing. Maybe some ice cream, I don't know, but it tastes amazing just by itself. So this is 30 grams of protein, which the other one was 20. This is 160 calories, one gram of sugar, 11 fluid ounces also. You guys, oh my gosh, this is my favorite by far. Even over the chocolate, and the chocolate is my favorite. The bananas and cream, absolutely amazing. I love it. Let's see. Sorry. Um, so I just, I guess I was on a flamingo kick, so I did pick up the flamingo um, ice trays. Now, if you guys have seen some of my other videos, I don't use these for ice trays. I use them for um, chocolates. And so I will be making some pink chocolate flamingos um, for my luau party, my let's get laid party. Um, sorry, let me just get a drink real quick. Um, I have been so dehydrated lately. And I'm dumping it all over. I'm sorry, hold on. So this is the ice drinks, guys. But this is the one that I can only find at Fry's. It's the Fruit Punch. Really good. Really, really good. I have a newspaper in here. Like, I didn't I never even looked at it. And literally the newspaper is from, I know it's not from this week. It's from like two weeks ago. From July 11th and today is definitely not the 11th. Um, I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna start couponing. I'm gonna start, no, I didn't even open it. So I really need to start couponing. I'm really cutting myself off every time, but anyways, um, yeah. Let's see what else is in here. So, if you, where am I gonna go? If you guys watched one of my other videos that I was doing, um, my kids had forgotten all of their like hygiene products. I said somewhere in my car rolling around is another thing of um, like body spray. I found it rolling around in my car, like I said. So this is a purple tag dominant and it's 3.5 ounces. It smells good, but guys, that blue one still smells way better. So I got that. I did pick this up. It's the Body Benefits um, for Body Image for him. Two by two face brush, dual action, contoured bristle head, non-slip grip, er ergonomic handle. Uh, uh, uh. Anyways, man hand approved. 
Okay, first of all, look, it's a, it really does say man hand approved XL. What if you don't have an XL hand? Huh. You know, that's going to make, that might make some guy feel bad that has small hands. I don't know. I was just thinking about it. I'm like, oh, that's, you know. Anyways, level of exfoliation is moderate. So I'm going to give this to my youngest son to wash his face if he doesn't like it. I'm going to use it because I think that this would be so awesome. And they have these um, for women and stuff. Oh my gosh, I'm, it's a horrible view, but at least you guys can see this, right? Who cares about seeing me? You can see the products. So anyways, I got this. It doesn't have to be for a guy. It can be for a girl. So anyways, that's what I got. Let me just grab the dang bag, right? Like instead of keep reaching. Um, so if you watched yesterday's video or whenever, actually it's probably not even gonna come up yesterday, so scratch that. If you watched one of my other videos, you're gonna see this double because I bought one of these, one set of these for me and one set for you guys. This is the hard candy. This right here, guys, was is going to be my absolute favorite, favorite, favorite lip, um, lipstick or whatever you want to call it. I am still hoping I'm going to give one of these to you guys, but you guys, when I wore this yesterday, I am in love with it. It went on so good and it, um, oh, the color was just beautiful. So this is the Velvet Mousse Hard Candy Matte Lip Color 1218. It's the Spider Orchid. Let's see, what are we gonna, oh, we're looking at me. <laughs> That's me guys right there with my phone. Um, anyways, you guys, this color, absolutely beautiful. I love it, I love it. And then this is also one that I was wearing yesterday. On top of that, it's the Hard Candy Plumping Serum, um, 0.12 ounces. Does it have a color? Okay, it's Swan Lake. So that I wore on top of it. It's so pretty, I love it, I love it. What is this one? This one I definitely got for you guys. Like, I'm so glad that this is a better view for this because it does cut off half of my forehead and I have a big forehead so I could just sit like this all the time and you guys would just think like I had a normal sized forehead. Yeah. Anyways, speaking of that, I don't know if I've ever told you guys this story, but when I was going to, I think like my eighth grade, um, like promotion dance or something, I went to go get my hair done. And I was like 13 or something. And the lady was like, ooh, I don't think we should put your hair up because you do have an extremely large forehead. Who tells a 13 year old that? Like, I am well aware of how big my forehead is. I definitely don't need to be 13 having a hairdresser tell me that and bringing out like the attention. I don't know. I was just like, yeah, I know lady, thanks. No tip for you, just kidding. Anyway, so this is the Hard Candy Marilyn Monroe, and it's the Glitter Liquid Eyeliner Long Wearing um, Plush Last Boosting Serum, 0.014 ounces. I don't know if it's a color or if it's black or whatever it is. It says, I just think the packaging is beautiful. Um, but this is 100%, oh wait, here it's at the top, Sparkling Roses. Does that mean it's red? Ooh, that's beautiful, but I'm still not going to keep it, but I think it is. Yeah, it's glitter eyeliner. I have tried to use just black liquid eyeliner. Mm, no, guys, like, <laughs> it did not work out. It was horrible looking, like horrible. I don't know which way I'm leaving. Yeah, I can't do it. So I did pick up some of these. I'm very excited. Like this is one of my favorite finds actually. These are the Metal Skewers by Cooking Concepts. First of all, can I talk about how we get four of them for a dollar? We are a s'mores family. Absolutely love making s'mores. So when we move into our new house, I'm going to make, um, I'm going to get one of the little um, toolboxes from Dollar Tree and I'm going to fill it and we're all gonna have a little s'mores kits. And um, just for like a little fun, like here's our new home family thing. I just thought it was cute. So I'm just gonna pack up some little things in there and make us each a little s'mores kit. And um, these, will be used all the time even after that because like I said, we love s'mores. So four for a dollar, yeah, that's 25 cents, yeah. Let me see what else I got here. Oh. Hold on guys, let's just put that there. This is um, just more, just so you guys know, of these amazing drinks. I'm so glad I got like five of them. Okay, so there's those. Let me just, reach in real quick. I think that's it besides the calendar. Okay. 
I've told you about these before, the V8 Sparkling um, Plus Energy Strawberry Kiwi, 11.5 ounces. It's 50 calories. Love them. Forgot it was in there, actually. <laughs> but I love them. So there's that. And then I got this, and I thought, oh my gosh, how cute is this going to be for, like, my kitchen? And so um, we can write down the menu all the time. Like, how cute. So it's an instant chalkboard. Um, chalk included and it's a peel and stick so it's four stickers that are seven by ten with four color chalks so it's eight pieces how cute is that gonna be for like um like one week I get, like so there's four of the actual chalkboards so I can like write um I can maybe put these on the outside of my boys' doors and like write a little message to them every day just so that when they wake up and they see it they can you know like hey I love you hope you have a great day um Excuse me, I'm so sorry. Um, and then, so that would be two of them. And then the other two, I could totally put in my kitchen, like, so that I can switch out everyone's chores every week. And so I can switch out the dinner menu every week. And I'm not wasting paper. I'm just going to erase it off of here and then make more. So I love that. And if you look at the back, like, they made it into hearts. And they, like, cut it into what they wanted. So I could literally, like, maybe put the ones on my boys' doors with hearts or whatever. I mean... So yeah, I think that's so cute. So I can write, like I said, little messages to them every day and then you rate, they can erase it so they're not embarrassed or whatever, but I just think it's cute. Drum roll. Don't want to drum roll too much because let me tell you guys, my camera will fall. It's like sitting on a nap napkin basket in the middle of my table. But let me just show you this. I did not take them all. So before, wait, let me just tell you. Before everyone yells at me and says how selfish I am and how this I am and how that I am, I did not take them all at all. And I have been going to the Dollar Tree specifically for these calendars almost like I say every day, which knowing that they do not get shipments every day, um, but like to one each day trying to find these calendars. But I did not take them all. So do not yell at me. Do not. I mean, there were so many at this store. And so and I'm not going to be one of those people yet again that are going to try to sell it online. If you remember the calendars from last year, guys, people were trying to sell those calendars for like $15. Yes, those calendars were beautiful. And these ones are. But I can't like that's when it upsets me. Hold on. I'm sorry. So without further ado, let me show you. So it says, enjoy the little things. And this is the 20, I had to look at it to see what year calendar it was, 2022. So what's funny is I went there and I was like, kind of done. It's actually the Dollar Tree that I never has anything, but it's the closest to my work. I've told you guys, I don't like going there, but it's the one I go to the most because it's closest to my work. And I was out of five hour energies and I was like, there's no way I'm going to make it through without these five hour energies. It was actually Friday. So after we went and signed on my house, um, and I was, it was already like 10 o'clock. I was already going to like, not late. Cause we don't have to be in at any certain time, but it was already like, I don't know. Like, I'm just like, I cannot, I'm not going to make it through today. And I was like, oh my gosh, I don't have any five hour energies. I'm definitely not making it through today. So I had to go backtracking a little bit to get to this Dollar Tree by my work. Um, and so when I went in there, I was like, I'm just going to really quick run through. And I just, I was like, oh, look, the desk calendars for 2022. Let me get one of these so that I can like get my YouTube a little bit more organized. And as I'm looking at them, I was like, wait, if these are here, where's the other calendars? And so then I looked down and I was like, oh. And I found them. So I'll stop talking. Anyways, here's this one. I'm going to be honest, not one of my favorites, but I did pick up several for you guys. So it's not going to be the greatest views, but so let me just put it right here. And then maybe you guys can like, if you want to see it, you can screenshot it and zoom in. So that's that one. This one I love is the farmhouse. I'm trying to get the glare off. Um, and let's see, August, this is where we laugh, love, talk, sing, smile, eat, and pray. First of all, can we not talk about the greater? It says, always be grateful. I love that. I love that. I'm going to make something with that. I love it. Um, this one right here, blessed beyond measure. I love puns. Um, life is short. Lick the bowl. Yes, please. Um 
Anyways, very pretty, very pretty. So there's that one. That's the farmhouse. Let me just put, I think I got three of each. And then this is the farmer's market calendar. Let me scoot that over. So there's that one. That's the front. So the front was kind of like, eh, whatever. But then you turn it around and you see the little pictures. And I'm like, wow, they stepped it up on the little ones. I would have thought that they would have put something better on the front so that it would draw more attention to it because these pictures are beautiful. But like I said, this one was kind of blah. I don't know. Um, so anyways, yeah, I thought that was very pretty. Let me make it through those ones. Um, I was just looking at the pictures. This one is thankful, grateful, and blessed. Very pretty with the woodwork in the background. Are you upside down? No. They just put the different. So there's that one. And then let's just look through. I'll pull this one out so I can see. Like it says home, the story of who we are and a collection of all the things we love. Um, this one right here with the bike, begin each day with a grateful heart. Um, I mean, just uh, this one right here with the mason jar that says Merry Christmas, y'all. So very cute. Very cute. Body goat. Um, mm-hmm save that one let's see what else this might be <laughs> okay so this is the last one I believe in the series um sorry my dog just opened the door to the garage Robert can you please figure out how Thud just got the door open to the garage and got out to the garage and now the rest of the dogs are following him all right guys look at this this has the little blue truck on it. It says farm fresh. That truck is absolutely beautiful. I just want to turn it this way so I can see. Um, look at like the woodworking on the back. And now let's talk about what's back here. So this one says flesh, fresh flowers and handmade bouquets. Happiness grows here. This is obviously the Valentine one. This one has absolutely beautiful flowers and a truck um this one has watermelons life is sweet and joy every day love blooms here this does not have a truck but look at the that's the bunny that is absolutely gorgeous this says freedom i absolutely love this love it um honeybees and flowers please and this one says enjoy the ride with the little basket farm fresh christmas trees thankful and happy harvest Yes, guys. So I got, I think, six of these, actually. So I got three of all the other ones and six of these. So, again, I did not take them all. But I have plenty for when I move into my new house. Hold on, hold on. To do giveaways. Which I will be. And so I will be sending these out with lots of other things. So stay tuned for that. And then also just a little more of an update once I do get moved into my um, house, I am going to start trying to keep some sort of normalcy with um, when I um, will be uploading and stuff. I try to upload every day. It gets a little bit hard. So, and then I have realized that since I took that break, I'm getting like no views almost. So, because I think people are like, well, we don't know when you're going to post, so whatever. So I think I'm going to start at least keeping a schedule that I no matter what post on. And then if I throw in a couple extra, that's great because I feel like a schedule is better and I know I work better on a schedule, so maybe my YouTube channel will work better on a schedule. I don't know, but with that being said, guys, cross your fingers for Wednesday or Thursday for me. And I cannot wait to show you guys my new house with the, my new pool, my new jacuzzi, our lake that's a block and a half away, and the golf course that my husband's very excited about, but I'm not a big golfer. So, all right, guys, I will talk to you later. I hope you're having a great day. Bye, guys.